So just a few things that you need um, when you're hanging your bear bag. Um, so right here I have a stuff sack. This happens to be a waterproof stuff sack, um, but you could also use your sleeping bag stuff sack, uh, provided that it has some kind of string on the end that you can attach it with. Um, I have over here a bundle of 50 feet of utility cord. Um, that's a good length to get cut when you're hanging a bear bag. Um, right on top of the utility cord is a carabiner clip. Um, you can use a standard keychain carabiner. Um, I have my food bowl here with my utensils um, because they probably still have some food on them even after eating my dinner. So those are going in the bear bag. Same with the food that I'm going to be eating later on my trip. Um, the sunglass case is going to be used to help me to throw the rope across the tree branch. Um, and the one thing that I don't have shown here um, are my toiletries. So things like um, toothpaste and deodorant, those are things you're going to want to put into your bag beer because they do have a smell. So I've tied my sunglass case to my rope. I, um, I, I, I uncoiled the rope to make sure that there are no nuts. Um, and this is my tree right here with the branch. Again, I want to make sure that the sunglass case is going to um, go over the branch about five feet away from the trunk um, because animals can climb up the tree in order to get to your food. Um, so I'm going to give this a shot and come back. Um, I have my sunglass case and my rope across the branch of the tree. I have the long end of the rope over here. Um, and I'm going to take my stuff sack, which is filled with my, um, my food and my toiletries. And now I'm going to take the carabiner and attach it to this end of the rope. So after I attached my stuff sack to the rope, I hoisted it up to um, a pretty good height so that it's still a few feet away from the branch that it's on. It's a good couple of feet, few feet from the the trunk um, and also probably at least six to eight feet above the ground. Um, I can even put it up a little bit more. The last stage of the process is to tie off the loose end of the rope to a neighboring tree trunk. So my bear bag is hanging pretty high and I have the excess cord of the rope tied off to a nearby tree trunk. Um, so this is basically how you hang a bear bag when you need your food at the end of um, at the end of your camping trip or the next morning. Um, you just undo the knot here, lower the rope, and um, and you can retrieve all of your stuff.